Hey guys, I'm Shadow Knight Paladin and welcome back to my channel. Today is another Tales of 69 Minutes speed drawing slash livestream and this time the theme is nail polish. Now the moment I read that prompt, I immediately knew what kind of pose I wanted to do. The problem became what kind or who rather, who was I gonna draw. And I did spend some time looking for someone even though I could have defaulted to my usuals, but I wanted someone different. So this pose is a little bit inspired from Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. If you're familiar with it, it's all over the place now, so you should be you should have heard of it a little bit. And it just seemed really fun and I wanted to draw it a lot, even though I didn't do a few drawings for this. Like, I skipped several props, but the moment I read that, I just had to do it. To be honest, I'm not really sure about my character choice in the sense that, I mean, at the time, uh, it seemed like a good idea, but her hair actually took so much time just doing the lining and then eventually the coloring that it, it may have been a uh, slightly bad idea. I did finish it in the end, spoiler alert, but um, I did spend a lot more time on it than usual. Especially since there are a lot of um, areas that are overlapping like the hand with the face and the other hand with the arm. I did use a lot more layers than usual uh, than say my, well, the, the past ones to be honest. I usually just use like one layer for the lining one layer for the sketching and the like but this time I had to use several for just the lines because things are overlapping and you have to erase some parts. I wasn't I wasn't fully prepared for it. So since um, the sketch turned out to be much bigger than what I expected, in the end I just let it be in a in this rough manner and I just went as fast as I could straight into lighting because I knew that doing her hair would take a long time and Mila's hair has a lot of the extra points like the highlights and the little green part at the end of her um, ahoge. I panicked a bit, I'll be very honest, and I did skip out some details like the little design on her skirt because I wasn't sure if I, have, if I had time to a lot to it.
so we're doing a really rush job of painting in the shadows and normally I would really take my time and you know not go over the lines but I'll fix that later if I have time which I did which was surprising Usually, I'd be a bit more detailed when adding shadows to the hair just to give it a bit more texture. This time, I just blob the color on. Because the goal here was block in all the colors, block in all the shadows, get some highlights in when it's necessary, and I'll worry about the details later. That's what happened. So now we're actually working on the part that's important, which is her nails. And maybe it's just me and a few others, but you know when you have really good nails and like it's well done, it's a nice color, like you just want to show it off. Yeah, that's what I wanted to do with this picture. Especially when you're the one doing your own nails. Like I've never gone to a salon and had it done since I was taught how to do it by myself. and. Doing it with your non-dominant hand is absolute hell. I just feel proud of myself when I went to graduation and my nails were really good and no one noticed that I just did it by myself. Best feeling. So very quickly, I just wanted to do the background just to give it a little bit more pop. And then I realized the green made the drawing too cold. And it, I don't know why, it blended, in, it blended in with me a bit. And then I realized that the green kind of sucks out the attention from the nails. So I just added an overlay. Or a multiply, I guess. A multiply layer over it. Changed around the opacity and crap like that. Make it, made it a color more similar to her eyes and it worked well at least it, it didn't take away the focus from her nails so we are nearing the end of the video i hope you enjoyed uh, subscribe maybe leave a like if you'd like and follow me on Tumblr, Deviant Art, Instagram, and see you around. <laughs>